Hey, happy Monday and welcome to Mrs. DeVita's art room. I'm um, sorry I'm coming to you a bit late today. Um, tonight we are going to draw cool cactuses. And with me tonight is my friend Karen. And Karen is a cactus. So let's get started. All right, Karen. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to keep this very simple. So simple drawing. We are going to start with our paper in the vertical position, straight up and down like that, the long way, also known as portrait. And what we are going to do, we're gonna take our pencil and we are going to draw an oval or what else, what else also known is an ellipse. All right, and that's gonna be the top of our pot. We're going to make a little lip of the pot, like right here. I'm my friend Karen, the cactus. I'm going to make the little top part. We're going to do that by coming in underneath our lips. I'm going to do a little shape. It kind of looks like that. So we have this ellipse or this kind of pancake shape. And then we go down, down, two parallel lines, and then a slightly curved line. Almost looks like a cake right now. All right, now we're gonna draw our pot. Your pot could be a little more short and stumpy or your pot can be a little bit taller. We're gonna come down, do two slightly diagonal lines on each side, one and two. All right, and you're gonna, what we're gonna do is we're gonna follow the contour of this by coming across just like that. Do you see what I just did? Kind of lifted the line right there. And I might need to fix it a little bit so I can kind of eyeball it. Keep it sketchy. Because you can always go back and erase. You can always go back over it. You can add details. So now we have a three-dimensional pot. Now my cactus right here, what I did is I made it a little more rounded. I could do a cactus that looks more like this one if I would like. But what I'm going to do... So I'm going to start by coming up. I'm going to make an upside down U shape of some sort. Okay? This looks like I have a little minion sticking out of my pot. And we talked about this previously, but when you have the reason we're drawing kind of sketchy is that we can come in and our cactuses, cacti rather, are not see through. They are what's known as opaque. We cannot see through the cactus, it's not transparent. So we're gonna erase that line in the back of the pot, like that. And then what you're gonna do, if you notice, the cactus has these little arms that come off, like this. You may make as many of those as you want on this one. On my more rounded one, I just made a couple little different ones. You like that. Almost like he's waving, right? Karen over here has lots and lots of arms. See? So you can make it taller and skinnier. You can make some arms coming off of the arms. All right. Let's see, maybe I wanna make one more coming off of there. Okay, maybe something at the top here. And what I'm gonna do, so I'm gonna make some lines kind of coming down my cactus on the arms and all that. Okay, I can make a few more. I can make them a little longer if I want. It's really up to you. That looks like a reindeer cactus or something, huh? And then what I'm gonna do, I can make as many lines as I want in order to make these little spikes that stick out. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make almost like a little star shape. So I'm gonna come in on those lines that I did, and I'm gonna do a little line that looks like that. Kind of a crisscross applesauce shape. Criss, cross, and then in the middle, like a star. Okay, almost like a snowflake. Crisscross, star, crisscross, star. And you can do those on as many of those as you want. You don't wanna get too crazy with it, but see what I'm doing? And 
you want to do some on the edges as well. So that way it makes it look a little more three-dimensional. Also makes it look like it's kind of sticking off the cactus there. And maybe I decide I can change it up. That's why I'm using I don't like that little part right up on the top. Kind of go along. And what I may do, what I might want to do, maybe I want to come in and make, say, like a cactus flower, maybe at the top or something. I can make a little, another little ellipse there. I can come down and make some petals by just doing like this, like one and two, one and two, like that. Okay. I don't have to have petal or flowers in my other little parts, but I might. It's up to your personal preference again. It's called the cactus flower. You want to put some little flowers on the edges there. Kind of bring it out. I can make them other little parts as I kind of go along. And what you may do here, you have yourself if you want to make yourself a table. If you want to make some sort of, maybe I want to make a design on my pot here. I can come in and I can trace it around with Sharpie, whatever I might want to do. Maybe I want to come in and do that. So we have ourselves a cactus. Happy drawing. Thank you for joining us. See you tomorrow.